processes and legal forum and opportunities available within the Constitution, we will contest the ruling. The judge erred both in law and in fact is a travesty of justice. But what is worrying, we don't want to believe that the courts of Ghana have been captured and that the courts of Ghana have become forums being used surreptitiously to tilt the balance of power. We are equal, 137, 137. What is happening is the courts now being used to tilt the balance of power and to weaken time-tested historical notion of checks and balances. Justice must not only be done, but must manifestly and undoubtedly be seen to be done. What happened this morning in Cape Coast, we are told that even when the Supreme Court of Ghana directed the Honorable Quisin and his legal team to go and file appropriate legal motions for the matter to be referred to the Supreme Court, he was denied that. That is repugnant and an affront to his right to a fair trial guaranteed under Article 19 of the 1992 Constitution. Danger begets our democracy with the developments happening. But as I've assured you, we remain unshaken, we remain very resolved, and cooperation will suffer. Nothing more. We thank you for the opportunity.